perception of this place. And how close were you? I saw the trees, and the water, and the rolling hill. But I could not foresee so much green. It is a magnificent and calming color. A balm for sea salted ice. What brings you? Hope there isn't a curse on the settlement or some such. Ha! <laughs> the only curse on this place is their great lout of a blacksmith. It is a rare feeling to travel across the sea and still find oneself at home. This place feels powerful, alive. Do you foresee great things for us? No need for foresight. I feel it in my heart. That Valka, I see. What took you so long to follow? Wanted to ensure the place was up to snuff. We must talk again soon, Randvi, once I'm settled. And before my arms fall off, what is this I'm carrying? My heaviest reagents, of course. Lead, whalebone, flecks of gold. Put this one to honest work. That is what I like to see. All these people you have brought here. This life you have built on these stranger shores. Does it please you? It does. To know that I have built this place and kept these people safe is a gift. You speak first of yourself when I ask this question. Which says more than you intend, I think. Salve, Eivor. Ad Meliora. Good day. And who is that fellow? I have no idea. Well, the town must be bustling. You see there? Your home is just ahead. Tell me about your visions. They are as they have always been. Little has changed, save their clarity. With every return, the things I see feel less like dreams and more like memories. And does the All Father still appear before you? From time to time, yes. He speaks to me as well, but... It feels mad to say such things aloud. I understand. You can put those just there, thank you. And here we are. Lovely, just as you promised. As soon as I am set up here, we can return to the matter of your visions. Valka, please. You are touched, Eivor. A conduit for godly tidings. Please, let me help. I may know a way to clarify these visions. An elixir that may open the door of your mind into the realm of the gods. If you think it would help, I can finish your home myself. Only give me some time. I would be grateful. Thank you, Eivor. Of course. And welcome home. This will do. Thank you, Eivor. Anything to help you feel at home. I am most at home helping others. May we return to the subject of your visions? We could, if you think it worth something. 
I need one more ingredient to finish an elixir for you. Look around the pond there. You will find what I require. Once brewed, this elixir will help you dive deeper into your visions, to see them more clearly. I have the plants you need. Good, good. Once added to the elixir, it will be ready to drink. In taking this, you will have access to the All Father's wisdom. You will walk the path of Odin and live as he lived so long ago. Prepare yourself for a journey into another time, another plane. The elixir is ready. It will taste like misery itself, but it will open your mind to the sights and sounds of the Nine Worlds. The prophecies of the Nonir are as clear as daylight. The Aesir are doomed. All Asgard is doomed. Repeat the last passage. Brothers will fight one another and kill one another. The home of the gods turns red with ghoul. It will be an age of storms. An age of wolves. Not this. Further along. The foretelling of a wolf, a great beast. The wolf Fenrir howls terribly before the gates to hell. The beast will break its bonds and run. And my part, what about me? Then comes the second great sorrow. When the Harvey goes to fight the wolf. And falls to Fenrir. And falls to Fenrir. It's there, you see? 
You have foretold my death. Your Javi will die. We speak what we see. We know your fate. Your destiny. Have you gleaned enough, O oh wise one? Why struggle and fight, if we are but threads stretched between anchored points? Without hope, life is a prison, not a gift. Life is the music that comes from playing those threads. That is what lifts our spirits and fills our hearts. I am no string to be plucked or tied. I am the High One, the Lord of Ecstasy, the enemy of the Wolf. I am eternal. Riddled words only cloud my thoughts. A storm is brewing. Not in the clouds, but down below. Does our final battle draw near? Is this how Ragnarok begins? to deal with these invaders, Thor. You cannot smash your way out of certain death. Who crushed the skull of Thrymur, king of the Yot? Who is balls? We are as guardians. We don't skulk around like elves. We fight! We are fighting for our homes, for our people. But some problems can't be solved with the hard end of a hammer. Name one. Harvey, break our stalemate. What's this? Another invasion? Warriors from Jotunheim. They attack from all fronts. While we sit on our trembling hands and scratch our bums. Not so, Thor. Many Aesir have been sent to the four corners of Asgard. Leaving we four to defend the Great Hall. Javi, lend me a score of your warriors and I will lead them into Jotunheim myself. We cannot afford such a loss. The Ain Hariar must hold back to defend our city. I would bring them here, to hold the Great Hall itself. This invasion is too large to spread ourselves around. All this prattle solves nothing. Battle or death! Silence! All of you! We will take the fight to the enemy before they cross the Bifrost. Well said, Ravenfeeder. Name those who may fight beside you. I need only one. You, Thor, Lord of Thunder. Together we will cripple the enemy before they grow too bold. Rouse every warrior who can hold axe or hammer. We're hunting Jotna heads! The rest of you, stay back to protect the Great Hall. Were any creatures among the Jotnar? Dragor, trolls, or wolves? What troubles you, Havi? 
Does your far side tell you something? More invaders! They gather at the Bifrost Bridge! Where's Loki? He should be guarding that door! Warn the others. The fight begins. Ain Herjar! Here is the battle you died to attain! For Heavy and for Asgard! <laughs> With me, I gift this battle to myself. to your Mungander.
I must staunch the flow of invaders. Asgard will fall! Not while I stand. this gate, and yet it was left open. What's that? You've done us no favors either, Jotun. Wait, no. You're, you're mistaken. I am no Jotun. Harvey. I found this one lurking in the shade, shying from battle. Shall I extract some teeth to get him talking? Or pluck out an eye? You were told to guard this portal, Loki. What happened? The portal opened, and these soldiers came bleeding through. So I sent warning straight away. And I captured this one, the soggy child sheep herder. <coughs> What's your name, stranger? I am called the Builder, by most. She wants your name, not your trade. If I have another name, it's not within my memory. Builder it's been for as long as I've been... building things. Why have you come to Asgard? To bow my bruised ego, I'll admit. The Jotnar did not appreciate my skills and crafts. And you thought we in Asgard might? Was it wrong to believe you and your kin possess a wisdom beyond measure and could recognize such a rare opportunity? Navi, when someone gifts you a horse, you ride it. I put a bridle on this one. Is that right, Builder? Are you a gift horse? Or a secret curse? Neither, I one. I am only a tool. One with hopes to be well used. This portal has been a source of misery for some time. I want it sealed. With respect, this is not the only way the Yatna can enter Asgard. May I propose a more encompassing solution? Quite a coincidence that you came when you did, at the tail end of a brutal attack. That I came when I did was by design. I have been among your enemies for so long, I know how they hunger for your demise. If you doubt me, I could offer a demonstration. A demonstration, yes. And if he fails to impress, we hoist his skin as a sail. I'll accept these terms, with the last condition. I would need water from your well of Ulf. What do you know of our sacred well? It's a place of great power and vital magic, a source of spirit. It's the water there that will power your shield. I'll collect the water, Harvey. Keep this one clear of our sacred sites. Loki, halt! I will go to the well. You must find this builder a clearing for his display. No, no, it's no trouble, Harvey. The damp and the dark appeal to me. Go with the builder, then return to the Great Hall with news of our next step. As you command. An interesting offer. A curious coincidence.
the Well of Urd. Not even I know all your secrets. The sunstone has been moved. The light's path has shifted. <laughs> These caves run deep. Needhog and his serpents have been busy. Loki said you'd be here. He told me of the Builder's request, an offer that gives me great worry. Why was this passage blocked? Has someone been here recently? Do you hear me, Javi? This Builder is a stranger to us. We know not what he intends. I am the King of Asgard, Tyr. Do not question my desire to protect her. Calm, old friend. What's needling you? Strange omens and wild portents. Something evil is stirring, and I cannot always sift the truth from what is false. Farseer, you have sighed beyond us all. I have no doubt you will prevail over what troubles you. I will need your strength in the coming days. To anchor me, to challenge me, to pull me back from the abyss, should I teeter. And I will, as long as breath fills me. So I must caution you. Step with care in this place. What happens here may ripple through the fabric of the Nine Worlds. The well is sealed. Someone labors to keep me out. Perhaps it is meant as a warning. I will take it as a challenge. I recall there being more light in here. These sunstones are meant to guide the light, but the path has been diverted. <laughs> what if an invader was trying to weaken the well's defenses? Are we meant to intervene? <laughs> the integrity of this sacred place must be preserved. But whether we be a bane or a boon remains to be seen. <laughs>
There are two targets the light must strike, but only one stream. How do two farms share one source of water? By splitting the stream. Once or twice. I doubt the Nornir will appreciate our visit. The curious are not welcome here. We'll have come and gone before they feel our presence. Now that the light is split, the streams must find their way home. The light has found its mark. The stone is lit. is open to us. I will lead. There's no wolf alive I can trust. 
Have you stopped? Out of my way, here! I'll suffer no walls in Eskadir. This is a sacred place. Killing here is forbidden. You know this, Javi. Has your mind fled you? You act as though possessed by the spirit of another. The Nornir warned me. A wolf will be my doom at Ragnarok. Will you slay every wolf in the Nine Realms to sidestep this fate? <laughs> Ridiculous. Take this beast. I want it caged. I would have every wolf and dog in Asgard caged if I could. To ease your troubled mind, I will do as you ask. We need you focused for the coming world. Thank you, Courage Bringer, for your steady hand. When one descends this deep, there's no going back up. Then the only way is further down. entered the well, did you not? And you found what you were looking for? I have a skin of sacred water, yes. Is the Builder preparing his demonstration? How did the well look? Peaceful, calm, quiet? What are you driving at, Loki? Driving at? I'm only curious. The well is a wondrous place. I wish I could see it for myself. There was a wolf cub with us. Trespassing on sacred ground. But Tyr took care of it. Took care of it? Is he dead? The wolf lives, but Tyr will cage the beast at his hole. I want no free wolves in Asgard. Ah, yes. Good. A wise decision, Harvey. I wanted to kill it, but Tyr stayed my hand. Tyr is pragmatic. And it serves him well. You should heed him more often. Now tell me plainly. Where is the Builder? In a meadow not far from here. Your raven may find the way. Cast about this land, my friend. 